Earlier, when Cyrus made his appearance at the gallery, Trina saw him and lost her mind. Certainly, he made efforts to fix things and went on to claim that he is not the same person as before. But she wasn't willing to believe a word he said. Later, when Spencer confronted Cyrus and told him that it was time to depart, Cyrus offered one more chance to make amends. It seemed like a big warning about what was going to happen. Cyrus insisted that Trina should come to him if she ever needs help, because he owned her. Moreover, he also claimed that he wouldn't want anything in return for helping her, but she yelled at him to leave immediately. So viewers are familiar with how situations such as this usually turn out. It is normal for the characters to promise that they will never do something in their lives and then end up doing it at some point in the future. The same is likely to happen with Trina since she just blew up at Cyrus with so much confidence that she would never ask him for help. It is possible that she will soon need a lot of help down the road. Maybe Spencer will run into some kind of problem, such as a situation where he faces the possibility of going back to jail or a situation that puts him in danger. As a result, in order to save Spencer from trouble, Trina might be compelled to turn to Cyrus. On the other hand, it can also be about Cyrus and helping him get back on his feet again. As we know, Cyrus runs a drug business. He could have several ties to modern medical procedures and knowledge about many drugs, which might help Curtis as well. Furthermore, if Esme regains her memory, she might become more dangerous than before, so Trina could also want help handling her. Whatever the case, it seems that Trina will turn to Cyrus for assistance down the road, and she may not have any other choice. So don't miss the drama ahead.